Well, hey there, team, and welcome back to the channel, and welcome to Blade Assault. This uh, this looks very stylish, very pixelati, very cute. Um, it's done by Team Sunny. I'm unfamiliar, but they're under the publishing house of Neo Wiz. We've had a couple of good hits come out of them previously or recently. Uh, things that come to mind are Skull, the Hero Slayer, uh, Metal Units, and Dandy Ace. Bunch of little gems that don't get nearly as much love as they deserve. Um, so I'm hoping this one fits into that category as well. So yeah, I'll check out Neo Wiz. Um, I think, uh, yeah, a, a good little indie slash, I wouldn't say even double A. So they're not like Focus Home or anything like that. They're absolutely still in that indie space. So I think Devolver Digital and that, but at a smaller scale, but still churning out some slappers. And uh, so fingers crossed this goes into that category. Um, Apparently, this is an action-adventure platforming roguelike. Uh, let's read the blurb. Blabed Assault is a 2D action roguelike platformer with beautiful pixel art set in a desolate sci-fi world. Fight against the corrupt military of Esperanza and part uh, as part of the resistance force of the Undercity. Bring the corrupt to justice by becoming stronger and fighting alongside your trusty comrades. Look! More, more roguelikes? Yes, please. I keep saying roguelikes are not a genre. They are a format, you know? PUBG is a roguelike for PvP. This is a roguelike for a side-scrolling platformer. Risk of Rain is a roguelike for a third-person shooter, right? These, the, these are all different genres, but they all have the same format of narrative arc, which is a 30-minute game with a three-part arc, which is called a roguelike. But anyway, that's more my sort of little bloody water to wage. Let's carry on. From that, I just hope that we see more roguelikes in the future. Um, and hopefully, Returnal's popularity uh, could signal a bit more of an uptick in roguelike format in the AAA space. But that's a conversation for another day. How cool does this look? What's going on? What's going on? Bit. Ta-da! Kill. It's too late. I like these names. It's too late. That's not the reaction I was expecting. I knew you'd come. It's always like this. Someone as clean as me has to suffer passing by that dirty vent. Or has had to suffer by passing that dirty vent. Complain later and do something about this jail first. Yes, yes, I'll get you out. Such fulfilling work. All right, okay. A bit of banter. A bit quippy. That's okay. Oh, and we're bloody into it. We're straight into it. Okay, can jump me to look at this. It's, that's a tight little tutorial splash. These controls feel quite tight. Who is this dude? Dr. Willis. I saw everything. I saw how you got out of there. Get me out. I'm sure that I can be of assistance. I know what you've been up to, Doctor. You know me? No, you know us? It'd be in your best interest to stay locked up there if you value your life, that is. If you know me, then you know, uh, then you should know how useful I am. I may know things that you don't know. I know all sorts of things. This man knows things. There's no negotiating this. Okay, right. We're very, very bloody. Not much to say, you know? Oh, here we go. Here we go. Man of few words, right? Dash. Okay. This seems like an appropriate place, laser. Oh, the controls feel pretty tight so far. Okay can break and drop down through platforms. Am I misunderstanding this somehow? Oh, I have to go down that little, okay, yeah, 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 okay, I get it, yep. All right, yeah, okay. What's going on here? Hey, hey, look at this. Oh, what are you doing? Is it okay to touch that thing? We just need to put it back before anyone notices. Oh, I'm feeling nervous. I am, I am, haha, <laughs> okay, yeah, okay. Very good pop culture references. Way to kill your game, but that's all right. Oh, here we go. Look at this. It's me fist. Sub weapon attack. Boom. Holy heck. Jeez, those blokes aren't going home to the wife and kids. All right. What is that? Are you just advertising the fact that you're escaping? It seems they mess with this thing. The output is set to max. Let's find a weapon first. The soldiers will be coming soon. I guess we should. We're trying to escape, right? Mm, that's reckless. We should escape. I like. I, I like it. It's. It's very. Like yes, it's a bit edgy, but the, the the dialogue is just short and snappy, and it's good. Let's go. You know, let's go. It sets a good pace. 
Look at this. I've got a friggin' lightsaber. Oh, wow. They're not even messing around. It makes lightsaber noises. What's this do? Insufficient energy. What's this do? Dash and then insufficient energy. Okay, look, I've got a lot of stuff on my screen now. All right. All right, here we bloody go. What is this? Oh, deal damage to enemies to gain MP. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, 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 Boys, boys, boys. Okay, this is just training. I get it. You can use weapon skills by consuming. You can use sub, sub weapons. Oh, yeah, yeah. How far does that fire? Yes. I think we get it now. This, it's, it feels good, man. It's tight. Look at this art. Electra, Kill, who is responsible for destruction of the headquarters computer network, has been arrested and imprisoned. While he was being arrested, he revealed that he had some unpleasant thoughts about Panis. Panis. Oh, that's you. What do you mean? I'm sure it was just a minor overreaction. His objective wasn't the just the network. Don't show him any mercy. Do you think I'm being merciful towards him? I am against you watching from the side any more than this. He's very useful, maybe even more than I expected. The plan is to carry out the execution at dawn tomorrow. A crime is a crime, and it carries the death penalty. Do you have any other orders? Yeah, right. Oh, look at this. Soldier. Reporting in, Kill has broken out of his cell and is possession, in possession of a weapon. Where did he escape to? About that, he's currently heading towards your office, as expected of him. I'll head out first to sort this out. Oh, wow. Wow, she's got fucking big steel clangers. Just immediately like, right, I'm going to go go deal with this. I'm going to frontline this. Oh, my God, yeah. I can shoot their, their bullets with my bullets. That's pretty sweet. Oh. I got it. Okay. I'll be honest. The dodge is a bit uncomfortable on red. Like, it feels more like it should be on uh, right trigger. Oh, my goodness. Feels like it should be on right trigger. Okay. That's right. I just got to get used to it. I just got to get used to it. Oh, that dude, that dude was all burnt up. Poor black. That's far enough kill. Oh, wow, look, she's got like a lightning sword thing. That's cool. Electra, if you had stayed in your cell, you would have at least seen the sun before you died. Such wasted efforts. You knew everything, yet you still news me. Was it fun? How much did you laugh at me for treating the person who killed my parents as my father, for pledging my loyalty? Oh, my God, there's a lot of exposition going on here. Used to? Don't make me laugh. I'm sure you already knew. It's dishonest to claim that you didn't know after all those missions. It's very obvious that there's a darkness to this beautiful floating city. Oh my goodness. I have no interest in the darkness. I just want revenge. Who do you think in this? <laughs> this is some schlocky writing, but I have to wonder if it's intentional. Like this is, you know, some serious B grade dump, but that's fine. Who do you think deceived you? Do you think that was me or Panis? Or did you trick yourself? <gasps> like it's melodramatic and I kind of, I'm here for it. Let's go. I don't need these riddles. They don't change the truth. <laughs> I don't need them either. And that doesn't change the fact that you will die here. Oh, geez, Louise. Electra's going to zap me. Oh, it's all right. Uh, there's like no sound effects. This happened in the other sort of cutscene. It's very strange sound. Die. Oh, no. Oh, no. Electra, wait, Panas. You seem to be in a precarious situation, Kill. Stay by my side. You won't get a chance if you die here. Panas, this person is... Stop speaking nonsense. Choose your last words carefully. You will die by my hands. Is that good enough of a response? Yes, look at him. He's hanging off the ledge. His robot's busted. He's going to get coup de gras. And he's like, I'm still going to bloody kill you. Yes. What a Chad.
That foolish, foolishness is very much you as well. Electra, it seems we don't need to delay Kill's death tomorrow. I'll leave the rest to you. Understood. Oh, but I'm going to escape from this. Maybe. Maybe not. Yeah, okay. Mm. I wonder why there's no sound in the cutscenes. Maybe. You know what? Let's just go with artistic decision. Jeez, look at this. Hope you packed your parachute. Team Sunny. This is, this is pretty cool, man. The, like I said, the, the, the story's daggy, but I mean, come on. Come on. People watch bloody Farmer what, and wants a wife and all that sort of stuff. You, they're not doing it because they want a bloody intellectual injection into the grey matter. They're doing it because they embrace the insanity and the schlock and the campiness and the junk food. And there's nothing wrong with that going for a narrative as well. well what's that? What, what am I doing? Okay. I'm in a house now, okay. I guess I didn't die after all. The Jazz Bar. Hello, sir. Armstrong, it's a good name. He looks cool too. Well, you're awake, please sit. I'm sure you have a lot of questions. No, it's fine. Are you the one that rescued me? A lot of people helped. A young woman named Haley was the one who found you. You should say hello if you see her again. I'm sure that'd make her happy. I'll do that. As expected, you recovered fast. You know me? No, I don't. I do know a few people who have white hair, though. It's good to forget the past and begin anew. This is the place for such things. I don't have the right to stay here. I don't know about you. I have my guesses. There are many people here with many stories of their own. Of course, there are many people who need help. I have somewhere I need to be. I'll think about it once it's over. Is that so? By the way, you should take the weapon that fell with you. Now that you're awake, go to the armory. Hank will be waiting for you. Hank, it was his room that you were lying in. He's a big fella. It'll be difficult to miss. Okay, all right. Let's have a wee wee. All right, very good. I like this art, this pixel art. It is uh, it is quite simple, but but very clever. All right, look at this giant she Sheila with a giant bloody wrench over there. Hank, look at this dude. That co there's some serious love and character going into these characters. Oh, you're up. I thought you'd be out of it for a couple more days. You're tougher than I thought. Did you heal me? Heal? Do I look like a doctor to you? I did some repairs. I replaced your terribly broken arm with my old one. It seems I owe you then, thanks. Oh, you didn't think you'd be one for sentimental thank yous, uh, but you're very, very welcome. He had an unusual weapon. Was he a mercenary? Similar. If you're good, catch the frog with the gun at the submarine base. What? It's a thorn in our side, and if you catch it, you'll be able to pay me back. I'll think about it. Where are my weapons? I also repaired your weapons and tweaked them a little. I'm thinking you'll find them much better than before. Go over there and test them out. Your weapons seem to have more room for upgrades, but I don't think uh, have the. But I don't have the right materials to make them. So if you find any good materials, bring them back to me. Sure thing. Hey, it's a bit strange that he's like, "Hey, your weapons are better now." Like this setup is the video game trope, right? You start as character at the end of his journey, meet your match in the intro, get smashed down to a depowered state, right? Usually with a douse of amnesia, but not so much here. It's strange that they're like, oh, well, your weapons are even better now. It's like, oh, okay, well, why don't I go fight the boss immediately if I was already at boss fighting state in the intro? It's just interesting. Haley, uh, you got to hit machines to get them to listen. Okay, well, okay. How insightful. Equip. Passive. All right, use these to pick up, pick an upgrade specific weapon feature. The same weapon will feel different depending on what you choose. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, I can upgrade them, right? Please select one weapon unique ability that will be used in combat. You can enhance that ability with chips. Increase normal attack speed. When an enemy is successfully hit with a skill, increase crit of all weapons by 3% for seven seconds. Does that stack? Interesting question. Hit with a skill, not with an attack. When a normal attack crits, recharge additional energy. Oh, these are all really interesting. Let's just, can I just freely change these? Yeah, we'll just do that. 
increase normal attack speed until I understand the system a bit better. So that's the weapon passive. Okay, cool. Now what's this? Active. Insufficient currency. Ah, okay. Damage per second. You're not gonna... Okay, maybe later. Maybe later. Activate. Here we go, straight into it. Undercity District 8. Oh, it looks good too, doesn't it? All right, smash some boxes. Smash some shit. Smash some enemies. Oh, it's like rat men. Look at them. And then bloody frog men. Or just frogs. There's no man part of this. They're just large frogs. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Oh, okay. We're shooting bloody lasers now. Increase to danger level one after seven seconds. Can I buy this? Where's my currency? I can't see it. Oh, um, increase damage done to immobilize enemies. Max HP increase. Increase weapon damage twenty percent for each space between you and the enemy. Oh, that's like long range stuff. No, no, I don't want that. Let's do this. Okay, I, okay. Oh wow, look, the damage level is spiking so fast. This is. I like that a lot. As I said before, I've been playing a lot of Risk of Rain. I uh, I love it. Um, oh, okay, cool. Now what's going on here? Activate. Oh, that's like a combat shrine, okay? Okay, this is all pretty graspable. Nice. And does that pay out or something? Maybe. Where is... Oh, 149 is down the corner. What is this? Cryogenic... Oh, heroic. Main weapon core. Adds cold energy to the main weapon. Enemies hit... Oh, okay. Dude, there is a lot to learn here. Frost arrow. Recharges one frost arrow every second. When three frost arrows are charged, the arrows will fly at enemies. Enemies hit are inflicted with chill. Rare, normal. I might take this, this because it's heroic. That sounds cool. Adds cold energy to the main weapon. That sounds pretty good. Let's do that. What's this? Or what's this? Do I have a map? Exit through the open door. Oh, I can't afford that. Maybe. Maybe I can. All right. The dim the uh, the level continues to climb. Looks like it's slowed down a bit. Okay, okay. Okay, so far, spamming attack, working fine. However... All right, what's this? Let's open this chest. Oh, here you go. Max HP increased by 10. Increased main weapon attack by 15. When hitting the enemy, there's a chance to steal gems from them. Uh, let's do this. We're not necessarily having a currency problem. Just more more attack is probably a good thing. Okay, this is good. I, I kind of like a, a roguelike with the ability to, to learn all the... Uh... Th their uh, abilities. Oh, shit. Right, okay, he went, like, red. Okay, there's so, like, these over-armored versions. This is cool. This is really cool. I'm enjoying it. Still getting a vibe for the combat. Um, okay, so I have to pick a room is what's going on. So do we go to a... Because I got chips then. Do I go to a money room or do I go to a chips room? Let's let's get m more chips because I thought we needed three. I don't know what else to call them. They look like microchip things. We needed three to upgrade our weapons back home, right? So let's see if we can get three total. I only really have the two abilities. 
but presumably I can slot more. That's I think that's what happened before. I add, added frost instead. You're all done. Uh, max hit points increase, increase main attack, basic attack skill, and 20% when you're at full HP. I like that. When you're getting hit, there's a chance to get gems. No, I don't need them. Let's do this. Let's do this. Star badge. Now, can I see a list of my items on the screen at a glance? I can't, but I can open it up here. Okay, that's interesting. Oh, yeah, let's do this boss shrine thing. Ah, bugger. Oh, I got a hamburger. Look out, boys. All right. Oh, we're getting powerful. I got my chips. These doors are busted. I have to go in this thing. Is that what's going on? Okay. Now what? Hotel Halona. Hello. Uncle Max, look at him. Even kids like you have to work now. I've lived for too long. I can't believe what I'm seeing. This makes us, uh, us no different from the Esperanza. I'm from Esperanza. What? Are you an exile? That's right. What's your reason for going back? Revenge. Then I guess that makes us comrades. I am Max. Some people call me Uncle or Uncle Max. You can call me whatever you want. You can't fight on an empty stomach. Order what you want to eat. Okay, yeah. I kind of love food mechanics in games. Here we go. So, oh, nothing's free though. I have to pay for it. Oh my goodness. Two friendship level required. Okay. HP recovery rate, 50. Increase max HP rice ball. Oh, yeah, you better believe it. Let's go. Thanks, Max. Do you put anything else in the food? It's a trade secret. Fair enough. I mean, look, let's not ask these questions. Paul? Oh. What is going on here? Who's this bloke? Rio. Are you kill? I'm Rio. I'm a hacker. Didn't you often see monsters that look stronger on the way? Even among the monsters, they assign them ranks of dangerous characters uh, and make them deal with more special guys accordingly. Uh, what? We call the grade danger level. If you ask for it, it might lower your danger level. Seeing that it's a request, it looks like it's not free. You should be relieved it was only possible because their network went down recently. That was me. What? Did you say something? No. Danger level hacking. What is this? Right. Right, so you can pay to reduce the danger level. Ah, that's interesting. That is interesting. Because it's constantly climbing, you can pay a premium to reduce it. Honk. What's up, kid? The name's Honk, dealer of bizarre gears that aren't available anywhere else. Gears? Okay, so there might be a language translation thing going on here. We've caught a couple of uh, syntax things, but that's not actually a big deal. You know, you can overlook that sort of stuff. Who cares? Um, like, at the end of the day, who really cares? Uh, I'll tell you what, all these environments, look at this limousine, this character, all the characters are so cool. There's some really interesting, innovative art and, and just ideas going into this. Really embracing that cyberpunk aesthetic. Feel free to look around if you're loaded. Uh, if not, don't waste my time. Right, here we go. So he's a shop. Oh, wow. That, but I can't afford any of this. Um, okay, sorry. Sorry, honk. Or I could restock. No, how about... um? How do I leave? How do I leave? Move to next stage. Here we go. This is... This is a cool game, man. All right, probably got some new enemies. <gasps> Bit of a, a bit of lag there. Okay, we got some rat men that 
Oh, wow. Bloody Ninja Turtle looking. Oh, is he a mushroom man? That's what he looks like, isn't it? All right. Bye. Uh, energy and weapon is charged over every five seconds. Charge weapons deal more damage. Okay, that's cool. Charge a weapon with energy every five seconds and stun enemies in a set area when you attack with a charged weapon. Okay. Thief's glove. When hitting an enemy, steal, steal gems. Yeah, look, you know what? We might actually take that after all because there was I wanted to buy stuff at that stage, but I couldn't afford it. All right. What is going on here? Popped it right in the face then. Nice. All right. Let's go. Oh, wow. He mitigates damage. Interesting. Trying to figure out if he's got, like, rear armor. Oh, it's like a bullfrog. Look at that. All right, they're starting to get a bit spongy, which is interesting. Nice. What is this? Activate. Electric weapon. Looks like maybe that replaces my thing. We don't want to risk that. Increase crit of all attacks. Dash upgrade. Dash can now hit enemies. Enemies that he hit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like that. Let's go. Oh, I had to choose one or the other. Mm, interesting. Okay. Uh, blue. What is blue? What is blue? Oh, wait. I don't know what the difference is between these things. Let's go blue. Blue sounds interesting. Okay. Oh. I kind of like the mobility of that attack. Oh. What's happened here? Am I dead? I'm dead. Interesting. I was actually, uh, well, I mean, hey, I died, but I was, I was looking at the clock and I was thinking maybe we brick out just to see how the meta progression goes. You know, I want to know what the end of a loop looks like. Okay, it looks like we're just back here. Got a whole bunch of bunch of shielders to chat up at the bar, so that's always good. We got this bloody dude to to talk to. Um, let's have a quick chat, Jack. Are you the new recruit? What do you think? It's not so easy outside, is it? Uh, who are you? Ah, uh, you're as disrespectful as they say. My name is Jack. I'm a training instructor in the Undercity. If you don't want to get beaten up when you're outside, you should learn some skills from me. All right, here we go. So we use the, the gold coins to unlock all of this. This training is under development. Um, okay. Hang on. Let's just double check. We are in early access. I need to... I'm trying to get a, a bit more into a rhythm at front-loading some of the information. Okay, so that's, that's probably part of the early access roadmap. Cool. Should probably just assume everything is in early access these days. Manage friendship levels. Right, so we've got another currency that we can buy to bloody get buddy with every. Oh my god, look at this bloody Edge Lord Sheila. Oh, look at this Edge Lord dude. Holy heck. And that, and that chick's purple. And those guys look like the same guy. Maybe they're brothers or something. Got different facial hair, but they got the same tooth. Interesting. Well, I'm sure that'll develop out. Oh, wow. And we've got like a sewer lid that we can... 
Maybe we can get down there later. That's cool. All right. This seems great. I, uh, I dig this game. This is a lot of fun. Um, there's nothing wrong with more roguelikes. It, the controls are tight, all right? There's a spammy attack and there's a very mobile flip dodge, but it looks look like maybe we could augment it. I, I should have made more of an effort to try and take the non-passives, you know, like the active things that change it. But it does seem like, look, we've got LB and RB and we've even got the sort of back slot. Oh, well, actually, no, that just shows you what you've got. But you can see down there, we've got at least two empty slots that we can put things in. So there is, you know, there's room to augment that. And uh, I suppose you can even change your starting tool as well, right? Let's actually just check that really quick. Right, we can change the passive. But here we can actually take different weapons by the look of it as well. Cool. Cool. So there is a fair bit to it as well. So it's, uh, yeah. So there'll be different styles that we can try out, but we don't have time to have a look at that today. This is sick. Blade Assault. Let me know what you guys reckon. If you liked it, let me know if you end up picking it up. Or if you even want to see more, we can turn it into a longer series if there is an interest for sure. All right, team, we might just leave it there for the time being, and I'll catch you guys on the next one.